So for the, the next line, for the next problem, we're going to find the equation of a line perpendicular. So again, making a 90 degree angle to x equals negative 2, but passes through the point 6, 4. This point right here is 6, 4. And we want it to be perpendicular to x equals negative 2. Now this is not your typical y equals mx plus b equation. All of the x values are negative 2. And so if I go over 2 on the x-axis, this equation represents all of the points that have an x value of negative 2. Negative 2, 1, negative 2, 2, negative 2, 3, and so on. And so this is just a vertical line. So this is my line x equals negative 2. If I want it to be perpendicular, I'm going to have to make a horizontal line. And so I'm going to make this line right here be horizontal. And so we're going from a vertical line to a horizontal line because they're perpendicular to each other. Um, vertical line has an undefined slope. Horizontal line has a slope of zero. So you can write it in y equals mx plus b, but it's a lot easier just to say, okay, well, all the y values here have the same y value, and that y value is 4. And so I can write the equation of the line as y equals 4. Just wanted to show you a slightly different problem, and that's how you do that one.